Hello, today we are going to learn how to draw any root rectangle from root 2 to root infinity. The definition of a root rectangle is a rectangle in which the ratio of the longer side divided by the shorter side is always equal to the square root of any integer, such as the square root of 2, the square root of 3, etc. The root 2 rectangle is constructed by extending two opposite sides of a square to the length of the square's diagonal. The root 3 rectangle is constructed by extending the two longer sides of the root 2 rectangle to the length of the root 2 rectangle's diagonal. Each successive root rectangle is produced by extending a root rectangle's longer sides to equal the length of its rectangle's diagonal. This is just a theory. I don't feel that it sounds very complicated, but now we'll explain step by step on the screen and it's quite easy. So to start, we are going to draw a square with the length that you decide. In this case, we chose one unit. If you don't know how to draw a square, you can learn by clicking the above link. So once we have this square, A, B, C, D, we start by elongating the bottom side of the square to the right, as can be seen on the screen. So now, setting the compass on vertex A and with a radius AC, we are going to scribe an arc to the right until it cuts the bottom horizontal line at a new point, which we will call E. And now we are going to elongate the top side of the square to the right also, as can be seen here on the screen. Now we are going to draw a perpendicular line, vertical line from point E, obtaining a new vertex F of the root 2 rectangle. And finally, we draw in a thicker line this root 2 rectangle. So A to E, E to F, and F to D, and back to A again. And here we have our root 2 rectangle. Marked in a thicker line. Okay, and if you divide the long side by the short side, you will get the square root of 2. So to continue, setting the compass on vertex A, and with a radius AF, we are going to scribe an arc to the right until it cuts the bottom horizontal line at a new point, which we will call G. So now we are going to draw a perpendicular vertical line from point G, obtaining a new vertex, H of the root 3 rectangle. And now we will mark this new rectangle in a thicker line again. So this root 3 rectangle is AGHD. If we get marked here. And we continue setting the compass on vertex A and with a radius AH we are going to scribe an arc to the right until it cuts the bottom horizontal line at a new point, which we will call I. And now we will draw a perpendicular vertical line from point I, obtaining a new vertex J of the root 4 rectangle. In other words, this is a 1 is the 2 rectangle because the square root of 4 is 2. And finally, we draw in a thicker line this root 4 rectangle, which is A, I, J, D. And we mark on the bottom the length, the square root of 4. And to continue, setting the compass on point A and with the radius A, J, the diagonal of the fourth root rectangle, we scribe an arc to the right, obtaining a new vertex K, and from this we draw a vertical line up, obtaining L, a new vertex. And again, in a thicker line, we will draw the new fifth root rectangle, which is AKLD. And you can continue as many times as you want following the same process, obtaining successive root rectangles. 
So I hope this video has helped you. Please press like or subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you. Until the next time.